Good morning, everybody. So as you can see, it's a very slow start to my morning. This is pretty much what happens if I'm working from home or if I am kind of relaxing in uh, over a weekend. I often start my morning with a good book. I'm currently reading Love and Color by Bolu Babalola. And I often like very slow and easy starts to my morning. It's very intentional. I choose to do this. But also another important part of my mornings is meditating and uh, taking some time out, relaxing. And this is how I do that. Welcome to this Abide Meditation. Do you ever find yourself getting lost in the noise that fills your social media pages, your news feeds, and inboxes? This is the point where I attempt to do some work. <laughs> I try to read my emails at this point if there's anything that I need to get back to urgently. I kind of get myself started for the day. I plan, I look at my calendar um, and kind of get ready for the day even though it's from my bed. Yeah. <laughs>
I, uh, you guys know that I love to sit on the floor and um, just wanted to give you a little bit of an update as to how the morning is going. It is currently 10 10, 10 08, 10 10. I'm, I'm calling it, I'm making it come into existence. What does 10 10 mean? People who know these things, what does 10 10 mean? Um, so I've actually been sitting in here maybe for about the past 15 minutes. Uh, my laptop is right here and I am technically working because it is during the, the week and um, even though today is my day off, I have a reason why today is my day off, but I am still uh, answering things, uh, emails and doing just making sure that things are getting done for her story and all that kind of stuff. So I am actually doing stuff and populating in my journal and my planners. Um, I've been working on this planner, decided to bring you guys closer. I've been working on this planner for, since maybe September, October last year. So it is an any year, any day planner. So you have to populate the dates and the times yourself, which I love. I got this from poetry. But then the one that I was waiting for arrived last week. This is the Boss Plus Planner, the one that I spoke about in my previous vlog. And uh, this is not a vlog, this is a morning routine, but you know, gotta, gotta squeeze things in there. Um, so this is the Boss Plus uh, Planner. This is the one that I was speaking about in my previous vlog. If you watch that vlog, you'll know. It got delivered last week. It is beautiful. If I tell you that there is, I have not seen a planner this gorgeous in a very, very long time. I mean, look at the tabs. Look at the tabs. Look at these tabs. Okay. And the tabs are written business goals, yearly goals, health goals, personal goals, financial goals. And I mean, let me, let me show you. Not financial goals because I've populated that. Fall. Let's do one which I haven't really had the time to populate. I've had it for like the, all of like three days, guys. So just give me give me a little moment here. I just want to project goals. No <laughs> projects of the year. So I haven't populated this, but look at this. Look at this. This planner is so gorgeous. It's clean. It's minimal. And I love the beginning of each month, right? You can see this. This is for March. It's a ring binder. So if you wanted to add something in there, you can actually open up and add more pages and stuff. It is one of the nicest, most professional uh, journal. Did I say journal? Planners that I have ever come across, honestly. And to think that as proudly South African, I am dying going to support them every single year going to support them every single year i need to i need to listen it's still the beginning of the year you can get yourself this planner because i haven't populated anything yet i just want to show you what it looks like look at this oh, i'm dying as you guys know i intermittent fast so it is 10 o'clock i can eat at around 11 because i did finish eating around quarter to seven last night so i can not eat around 11 but in the meantime I need to just populate some things on here, ensure that I double check the emails that just came through, and then we can continue with the morning routine, okay? Okay, bye Nia. Give you all my time, I wanna make it good for you. Dun, dun, dun.
it is a breakfast time hey before i start with that i mean i've got a pretty nice spread here so why not take a picture okay flat lays baby girls flat lays look line gotta align everything breakfast set up there we go Oop, need the camera cord out there there we go i am done now i can eat my breakfast make some notes on here I have made this multiple times on my channel, so my hair is a trip. I need to go and get it cut, but it's okay. The cases are still quite high in South Africa, so I'm waiting, waiting it out, and then I'll probably go in the next couple of days, but they have come down quite significantly. So, yeah. So this is my morning routine. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you're wondering what apps I use in the beginning of the video where I'm in bed, I use the, in my mornings, I use my Abide app quite a lot. I listen to relaxing sounds and also have like a five minute sort of meditation session while I'm in bed. This is on the mornings where I'm working from home or just a weekend morning. I don't do this every single day. And then at night, I use the Bible app to get my verses of the days, to see what's in the Bible app community, what's been talked about, what's been said. Um, specific readings for specific feelings or what you may be going through. I check that out every single night when I go to bed. And that's pretty much it. Yeah, that's pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed this little intentional slash quite realistic morning routine of when I'm working from home or a weekend. I am going to go because I do have work to do. So I will see you guys. That includes editing this video. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.